Hi, this is Sherry Veronica. Shopkeepers are talking about playing it safe. Surveillance is not playing it safe, okay? You're going to have to do in your cashier area what you do to your homes. Put up a wrought iron protection. You're going to have to have like, don't call it a cage, but you're going to have to put the cashier and the box the cashier box and the money area you're gonna have to have that barricaded well maybe not barricaded you're gonna have to have it um i don't know what other word to use but you're gonna have to have it fenced in oh you can't say fenced in okay you're gonna have to have it oh you're gonna have to have it safeguarded and surveillance is not um what you need that is in addition surveillance is going to be in addition to you putting up the rod iron you know enclosure enclosure mm -hmm. a rod iron enclosure and you have to have the enclosure that has little holes like little pockets of holes so that anyone behind there can breathe because you don't want the rod iron enclosure to have an opening so that the guy the person with the weapon can still like you know far in and shoot through you know you, you still have to protect from that happening so you're gonna have to have that um, plexiglass thingy the plexiglass but you're gonna have to have it um perforated in different areas so that the air can come through and you know everyone back there you have to you have to have air conditioning then in your store in that area so that you know everything is like nice and the the condition of the air is really good and you're gonna have to have people behind um that partition you can have to do that talking about surveillance cameras with what is going on in Barbados and what is coming out after you know 13 years old 15 what is coming to get you once they reach a certain age no surveillance is not going to cut it okay you need wrought iron enclosures with an added plexiglass kind of thingy so that you know like can ricochet things can ricochet off of it you know that kind of stuff and you have to start thinking that way it's not going to be a good look it never looks good we have it here in the united states it never ever ever looks good it's in the areas you know that you wouldn't really want to run out of gas right driving through you, you just don't in fact you don't ever want to drive through some areas okay so but you will find that enclosure in those areas and it shows the kind of life and the kind of way that that particular area society that demographic it shows you the way they live and you, you, can, you can tell that the prices home prices and the land prices everything in that area is depressed you can get it for cheap you know why no one wants to live in that area no one wants to be there Okay, so don't like try to get yourself there. You don't want to get to that point, but you're at that point. You are at that point with what's going on in Barbados. You have to protect yourself and surveillance cameras are not going to protect you. The police are not there to protect you. They're not, they're not bodyguards. They're not there to protect you. After something happens, they're supposed to come out and investigate. But before it happens, you have to protect yourself. You have to protect yourself. It's all on, it's all on you. It's all on you, Sherry Veronica.